my sir, Shashi. Veena and Sardita are here. It's not Shashi, it's Charlotte. And for God's sake, get their names right. Okay, okay, okay. Calm down. I know what I am doing. <clears throat> uh, Sardita! <laughs> Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so nice of you to invite us. So nice of you to come. <laughs> oh, well, we wouldn't miss the Kapoor's barbecue for the world. Hey, pronounced Koopa. <laughs> of course. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, what perfect weather you've chosen for a barbecue. Mm, it's simply marvellous. If anything, it's a little too hot, wouldn't you say, Dennis? Uh, well, I believe that mad dogs and Englishmen go out in the midday sun. <laughs> and after all, my husband is uh, an Englishman. Which must make you the man. Another jug of pims, darling. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis, could we... Uh, Dennis? De Dennis? Oh, oh, so sorry, old chappy. Just keeping an eye out for that mad dog you mentioned. <laughs> Sounds a bit dangerous, what? There is no mad dog, Dennis. It is a line from a song by Noel Coward. Oh, I knew that. I knew that. Buggers all round, eh? So, where is that son of yours, Subhash? Uh, you mean Man Sebastian. Sebastian. <laughs> yes, I take it he's turning up to his own homecoming party. Hi <laughs> there, here he is. I say, Sebastian. Oh. Come and say hello, oh. hey? Hello, <laughs> Uncle Surajit, Auntie Vina. <laughs> Sinjin and Vanessa, you little. <laughs> so, how is Master Cooper these days? It's pronounced Kapoor, right? Oh! <laughs> Wag. Oh. So, um, I hear you've been travelling all around India, Suba. Eat sea bass, hmm? Yeah, I wanted to get back to my roots. We are Indian, after all. <laughs> Why don't you go and have a lie down, Sebastian? You're obviously jet lagged. Look, there's nothing wrong with being Indian. <laughs> have I mentioned the weather, old PP? <laughs> For God's sake, we're Indian. We're the Kapoors. You're the Robindranaths. Robinsons! Oh, please. <laughs> Darling, you see, you were born here, brought up here. We, we sent you to a bloody expensive public school. <laughs> we both thought you were the perfect English gentleman. Well, I'm not English. Yes, sir, Bakwase. Anyone may fancy a game of croquet? Ball? Yes. The Morrison dancing? <laughs> I mean, you're not fooling anyone. You're serving pims with courgettes in it. <laughs> you haven't even lit the charcoal. All that meat is completely raw. <laughs> Shall we evacuate to your lavatorial conveniences? Uh, evacuating? evacuating. <laughs> so, do you have any trouble finding us? No, straight through on the A10 and then the B3118. <laughs> Late arrivals. That'll be the neighbours. <clears throat> Oh, no blood. Yes, and they're very keen to blend in. Guys, this is Surgit. Sinjin! And Vanessa! <laughs> Hi, I love the costumes. What made you choose them? Well, you did say that you were swingers. Four! <laughs> there we go. I'm sure there'll be plenty of time for foursomes later on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. Vanessa's been up all morning polishing my wood. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, I wouldn't have had to if you didn't take such big divots with it. <laughs> <laughs> Divot. <laughs> yeah, well, anyway, I suppose um, actually you'd be wanting to mingle and let your hair down. And... Well, actually, there's a couple of people here who I'm sure you're going to get along with really well. Oh, it's oh, hey, <laughs> Dennis, your party animal. Ah, oh. oh, I see your old friends. Ha, 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 yes, yes. Ish. Glad you could both make it. <laughs> Don't mention it, old fruity. I see the baby's up a bit late. <laughs> oh, it's not a baby, Dennis. <laughs> he knew that. <laughs> Great. I expect you'll find this whole scene very tame. Yes. I expect you get up some pretty exotic things where you come from. What? You, you mean next door? <laughs> I mean, uh, you know, 
You could probably teach us a lot of thing or two, eh? But we British, we're so sexually inhibited, don't you think? Mm. Uh, yes, we are. <laughs> I'm very inhibited, uh, sexually. <laughs> so is Dennis, aren't you, dear? Uh, thank you. Huh? <laughs> I was just saying, Dennis, how sexually backward you are. Oh, yes, completely useless. <laughs> Uh, then again, there's nothing more British than a good orgy. Uh, I should cuckoo. <laughs> uh, yes, we're always having orgies at our place. <laughs> very naughty, very British. <laughs> well, our house is a cesspit of sexual degradation. <laughs> well, St. John is frequently beside himself with sexual rage. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you think you've had enough, dear? You wish. Well, <laughs> if it's an orgy you're after, <laughs> we'll jump in any time. <laughs> Fill the bath with baked beans, huh? <laughs> Chain me to something painful. <laughs> Spank me hard and call me Barbara. <laughs> How about a bit of wife swapping? Oh, swapping, swapping. Uh, a set of screwdrivers for Charlotte. <laughs> I knew our Asian guests would spice up the party. Yeah. What? So you have Asian guests? Oh, too hardy. Oh, dear. <laughs> we really should be going. Yes. Oh, hang on, what about the orgy? What? With the Asian people? Oh, yeah, you, you perverts! You're disgusting! Oh, go on, we're leaving. Let's just leave it alone. Sinjin and Vanessa. <laughs> uh, Dennis, you old bogey collector. You ready for a quick round on the old links? Any time, but let's get the golf out of the way first. <laughs> the links is the golf course, Dennis. I knew that. <laughs> Shall we tee off? A ding, ding. <laughs> Can't hit the bloody thing! <laughs> um, say, darling, I've got an idea. Why don't we turn the stick around? <laughs> Actually, they're called clubs, not sticks. Yes. Are you two sure you've played golf before? Uh -huh, uh -huh, of course, of course. Uh, we are both members of the Royal and Ancient Chingford Golf Stick Club. <laughs> sure? Yes. I knew that. <laughs> Let's try this end. <laughs> I've hit that thing a mile. <laughs> that thing is called a divot. And it's supposed to stay on the ground, like your ball has. <laughs> I say I'm absolutely part. Care for a spot of whiskey, Charlotte? No, thanks. Not while I'm driving. <laughs> <laughs> I say, where's Dennis got to? Oh, here he comes. So, sorry, chaps. Just been for a tinkle. What? You went all the way back to the clubhouse? No, I went to that latrine. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bunker. Sure. Yes. I didn't know that. I hear. Who's this chap? What the hell are you people doing on this course? Dig off! What are you up to? Look, you can't play here. It's just not on. Why not? Because this club is restricted. I'm not sure I'm with you all, Fruity. <laughs> well, let me put it this way. How many Asian people have you seen playing on this course? I haven't seen any. That's right. And they usually get everywhere, don't they? <laughs> and another thing. Are any of you lot called Dennis Cooper? <laughs> yes, uh, how do you know? Because you've written your name in the sand. <laughs> uh, Dennis, shall we move on to the 19th hole? Oh, oh I've had enough of golf. Let's just go straight to the bar. <laughs> Thank God you brought the golf cart. <laughs> uh, absolutely. Good afternoon. 
afternoon. Are you expected? Yes. And whom shall I say is calling? You shall say Mr. and Mrs. Dennis Cooper. Very well. Step this way. A stepping, stepping, stepping. Ah, how bloody funny you are, dear. May I take your hat, sir? Uh, no, get your own. Is one of them could hang it up for you, darling? <laughs> I knew that. Dennis, Charlotte. Oh, oh, Sarjita! Sinjin, darling. Both wrong, actually. It's Lord Sinjin of Epping. <laughs> and Lady Vanessa of also Epping. How marvellous. <laughs> yes. The titles came free with the stately home. Let's give you the guided tour. <laughs> this is the entrance hall built by Henry the Tenth. Beautiful. A spiffing. Uh, notice the 16th century floorboards uh, laid down in 1348 by Edward XXII. <laughs> yes, the plastic hallway matting complements them perfectly. <laughs> uh, what's this? Uh, this is the stained glass window. Uh, stained, huh? Have you tried rubbing it with vinegar? <laughs> it's stained on purpose. He knew that. <laughs> uh, we've started work on the garden. Having it all taken up and putting a 15 acre patio in its place. <laughs> oh, would anybody else like a drink? Another Pims? Of course. Dennis? Oh, just a drink for me, please. I'll drink for Mellows. Tell me, Sinjan, what's that strange smell? Ah, the smell of the countryside, Dennis. Horses, don't you know? Ha! Huh. Have you horses? Not bloody likely. I can't stand the buggers. <laughs> yes, that's why we buy a bag of manure every week and leave it in the corner over there. <laughs> Gives it that authentic country feel. You back, my lady. Uh, yes, Mellis, could you get our guests a drink? Certainly. Mr. Cooper? Hey, I'm not! Two glasses <laughs> of whiskey, and it's a tough don't speak to the staff like that in the country, Dennis. <coughs> one jug of pims and one jug of whiskey, Mellers. And hurry it up, or I'll give you a damn good thrashing. Who and what's that? Ah, uh, the family crest. Yes, it uh, shows a British bulldog rampant in a field of royal blue. And inscribed above, the family motto: "Si non est Albus." Not nest bonum. What does that mean? If it ain't white, it ain't right. <laughs> oh! I say that fireplace must be lovely and warm in the winter. Yes, although we haven't actually managed to light it yet. Yes, but the neighbors have been very helpful. They bring round wood and fuel and matches and light it all for us. And then just pop it through the letterbox. <laughs> Charming. Yes, folk in the country are so much more friendly. Mm. They've even invited us shooting next week. And they've even offered us a 15-second head start. Sinjin, <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> and Vanessa, for God's sake. Oh. Cross yourself, dear. <laughs> well, 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 it isn't Dinesh and Shashi Kapoor. Well, well, it isn't. It's Dennis and Charlotte Cooper. Of course. Well, what are you two doing here? This is for members of the Church of England only. Of course. We are members of the Church of England. We are English, after all. And what could be more English than spending Sunday morning with a bunch of men in dresses? Cassocks, Dennis. No, it's true. Look. <laughs> well, we English take our religion rather seriously. Yes, we do. <laughs> Dennis and I love all the English gods. <laughs> there is only one god, Charlotte. 
Haven't you read your King James Bible? Oh, of course, of course, of course, sir. Nearly finished it. But don't tell me what happens in the end. <laughs> <laughs> Gospels, Charlotte? Yes, sir. Of course. There's Matthew and uh, Mark. That's Porty and Pash. It's Luke and John, actually. I knew that. <laughs> That's it. Yes, let's go in. Yes. Hello there. Hello, my old chappy. Dennis Cooper. Table for four, please. <laughs> yes, please. Not too near the band. <laughs> we don't have any tables. Ah, come on, my old fruity. I'm sure you can find us something. <laughs> please take a pew. Ewing. 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 <laughs> Are you frequent flyer? <laughs> what are you chaps doing here? Oh, we've just seen our youngest off to finishing school in Switzerland. Ah, quite right. Uh, what is he finishing? <laughs> he is finishing potty training. She's almost three. The English don't like to keep our children clinging to our apron strings, you know. Quite right. That's why we sent our youngest boy off to Rodine when he was only two. Rodine. Isn't that a girl's school? Well, he got in. <laughs> so what are you fellows up to? I'm waiting for my mamaji and papaji. Oh, to our dependents. He means his mater and peter. Of course, uh, maker paper. <laughs> yes, uh, we're a very close family. <laughs> Dennis's parents visit at least three times a year. <laughs> <laughs> what a queer lot you are. Who are you calling queer? <laughs> No, no, it's just that we English are never very close to our families, are we? That's right. What could be more English than to hate your in-laws? I knew that. I knew that. I think that Charlotte's mother is a fat cow. <laughs> Dennis's father's a right twat. <laughs> but I would never dream of visiting Vanessa's mother. She's a pig. And she lives in that smelly, horrible little place. Actually, darling, I think she's bought a new house. <laughs> no, I meant India. Disgusting <laughs> <laughs> place, absolutely. So, your parents are coming to stay with you in your house. Mm. The extended family. How very ethnic. <laughs> Not at all. There's nothing ethnic about it. <laughs> they will be paying full rent. Breakfast <laughs> not included. Check out by 11. <laughs> no petting in the shallow end. <laughs> Tickety-boo with that, are they? Oh, yes. Dennis's parents are as English as, um, as we are. <laughs> I say, there they are. Oh, yo <laughs> Yes, there they are. Come on, Dennis. Oh, Peter. Peter. <laughs> you must be Sarjita. <laughs> Sarjita. <laughs> it's Indian Dennis, you drooping brewer. <laughs> what are you doing here? Well, we British love to come down to our local for a pint. Ooh, of course we do. <laughs> oh, Vanessa, hi. Not yet, but I'm working on it. <laughs> I hope you've left us something to drink. <laughs> Old peculiar cobblers, Dennis? Yes, this bloody trousers on <laughs> I think he means, would you like something to drink? I knew that. <laughs> yeah, three uh, pints of cobblers, please. And a uh, yard of ale for you, Vanessa. Um, I think I'll try a yard of vodka now. <laughs> uh, Dennis, why don't you uh, grab a table? Oh, grabbing, 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 grabbing. Well, I must say I'm very surprised to see people like you in the pub. What do you mean by people like us? 
Well, it is a peculiarly British habit, is it not? Yes, and we are peculiarly British. Ha 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 ha, we're as peculiar as they come. The pork scratchings, Dennis. <laughs> Uh, well, I, uh, I I often like to pop into the pub for a quick aperitif. Oh, well, you do have that aperitif dependency problem. <laughs> hey. Well, uh, they don't do a yard of vodka, so I thought six inches would be enough. <laughs> yes, that's always been your problem. <laughs> oh. I thought I'd order us some food. Oh, lovely. And what could be more English than a pub lunch? Ah, absolutely. Yes. Roast beef. Oh, super. Yorkshire pudding. Oh, lummy. Horseradish on your meat and two veg, eh, Dennis? No, for the last time, will you bet <laughs> Oh, what a lovely view of the village. Ah, ah yes. yes. Well, this is the England that I love. Oh. A hearty Sunday lunch yes. in a local pub. Warm beer. Cricket on the green, mm. young maids cycling off to church, cream teas, <laughs> young boys scrumping for apples, making jam for the village feed, the smell of newly mown hay, strawberries with cream, cider with Rosie in a lark rise to Canterford. Uh, darling, I, I think that chappy wants a word. Ah, yes, what can I do for you, start human? <laughs> Who are you calling stout, Gunga Din? <laughs> <laughs> there appears to be some misunderstanding. See, my name is Sinjin. And this is my good friend, Dennis Cooper. How do you do? <laughs> no, mate, I don't think you understand. We don't like your sort round here. I'm not sure I'm quite with you all, Fruity. <laughs> Why don't you all go back for him where you come from? Well said, Epsy Bar. Um, I think I know what the problem is. What? what? Well, um, they obviously don't like strangers here. Yes. yes. And we're... We're, we're what? what? We're from Chigwell. Oh, yeah. Right, light them crosses, Epsy Bar. Oh, 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 God, I think we're in a bit of a pickle. Uh, are we going to die? Oh, yes. Ah. Well, we'd better start praying. Yes, uh, uh, our Father, which aren't in the heavens, uh, uh, do something, you yeah. are. Oh, God. Thank yes. you, God. Yes. 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 